Welcome back. My name is Carrie Waltz. I share tips, tools, and techniques for the artist in you. And today's video is a continuation of the last one in my visit to the Smoky Mountains. If you love art and mountains and beautiful scenery, please take a look at what the next few days in the mountains were like as I followed the artists that were invited to the Smoky Mountains to paint beautiful renditions of their inspiration to raise money for the Friends in the Smokies. Consider saving the date for next year and going yourself. I won't be there. Hopefully I'll be in Italy, but I think you'll really enjoy the time away to watch others paint and maybe consider taking some paint with you and doing your own interpretation of the area. It's just a beautiful way to get away. So think about it. I'm here at Elkmont campground area looking for a place to paint. There are two invited artists for the plein air event. One's there and one's up on the hill. They're all over the place, but I wanted to do some of my own work, so I'm going to sit in this little nook and take advantage of it. I'm not really drawn to man-made objects, but that's so bright in the sun, I thought I'd try to make that my focal point and see if I can get the other watercolor dark enough that I can um, leave that as intense as possible. I've been working on this for about 20 minutes and trying to decide. I'm thinking I'm going to leave it as a vignette. I'm going to finish some things over here to the left. Um, but we'll see how it goes. I think I need to finish the trees on the left at least enough so they don't look unfinished. And then I'll call it a day and look at it later. Maybe even add pen. I decided to stop at the Towns and Y and do one more sketch before I head home. What caught my attention was this tree with the light coming in on the bark on the trunk and then just the distant land with the people. So not sure if I'll include how much I'll include but the trees what caught my attention more than anything and I really like the dark shadow of the tree in contrast with the light in the distance. I stopped at 10 minutes to document what I've captured. I wanted to start with the light in the background. Well, now I shift back to the tree area. So I let the, the other part dry that I just painted. Sorry about the glare. I'm about to head out to day two of smoky uh, painting. I'm heading out for plein air smoking. Plein air smoking. <laughs> uh, 